Yo, people, what's up? This is Malcolm Extreme, the content machine, coming at you with another Star Trucker video. Uh, yesterday, we did our first gig, and uh, we're going to continue where we left off. It's going to be kind of like a, a series. I'm going to keep the series going as long as possible. So, yeah, if you enjoy, make sure you hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, and hit the bell for more notifications from the content machine, Malcolm Extreme. Let's get started. Let's get started Star Trucking. Okay, so the last time I played, last time I played, everything was all discombobul discombobulated everywhere. Things were floating around in the air. I had to put the uh, power cell to get gravity back online. So I did that. Everything I had back here got damaged pretty much, except for a few things. I don't know what this does. I don't know what this does. UCCs. Oh, I put it in here. Yeah, this is the UCC. It still got 79 out of 100. So it's pretty good for now. Uh, I think this one, this one is actually still good to use. I'm gonna put some of the stuff in the cases. I actually put some of the stuff in the cases. One thing I wish we could do is actually sleep on the bed. That would actually be pretty cool. In Star Citizen, you could actually use your bed. Which is actually really nice. This thing is garbage now. I wonder if I could just throw those away. Unlock a certification is on my, uh, big, what do you call it? I gotta figure out how to do that. Let me back out of this real quick. I like the full immersion. I'm gonna try to stay out of third person as much as possible. So it says unlock a certification. Let me figure out how to do that. Cargo, skills. Oh, certification skills. Okay, cool. So this was a skill tree. After I finished the first gig, I, I was actually able to level up, so I got a skill point. So certification skills, complete jobs to earn experience and gain skill points, spend skill points to unlock new certifications and perks. Okay, so this is what I could do. I could go the speed demon, demon route, and get 5% XP for just-in-time jobs, plus 10% more cash for delivering just-in-time jobs. This unlocks jobs with uh, tight deadlines. This unlocks jobs with fragile loads. I have to be really, really careful with the cargo that I'm hauling if I choose this one. But with this one, I just have to be a speed demon, bro. Just have to absolutely be a speed demon. Do I hate myself enough to do... Like, how tight are the deadlines? I really wonder. I kind of want to go with this one. I kind of want to go with this one. Let me look at the skill tree just a little bit longer. Ah, uh, you know what? I'm probably gonna have to do both at the same time because the only way I'm gonna get three trailers is if I do both. So I'm eventually gonna have to go up this tree anyway. But for now, I'm gonna just go with Fragile Loads. I honestly don't know how much more money I would make with tight deadlines. I honestly do not know. But then, like, if I go with, if I go with just-in-time jobs, like, I won't have to worry about, like... Uh, the cargo being too, how you say, uh, won't have to worry about the cargo. I would have to complete, I would have to complete the missions fast, but I won't have to worry about the cargo being, how you say, fragile and getting 10% more the cargo. Yeah, you know what? This is probably the right choice. Since I'm new, this is probably the, the better choice because like me handling my truck will be a freaking nightmare for a little bit. <laughs> So, you know what? I, I think I'm going to go with just the time. All right, all good in the neighborhood. Come find me at Harmony Link over in Atlas Prime if you're interested. Okay, we got to go back to Atlas Prime. Get this job. Oh, shit. See what I'm talking about? I'm not the best at uh, stirring my ship right now. We got to go back to Atlas. Let's go back to Atlas. Let's do our thing. That never gets old, baby. That never gets old. I think I could get everything I need at Atlas Prime, too. What the fuck? What the fuck hit me?
Bro! Like, hit me out of nowhere. I don't even know where that... What happened? Yo, someone hit me. I gotta patch my truck up, man. It has to do. That has to do. No, I, I'll turn this shit on when I'm back at, uh, at Atlas Prime. Alright, I'm back at, uh, freaking Atlas Prime. What the fuck? Bro, what's your fucking problem, bro? No, I'm getting freaking slammed everywhere I go, man. My, my truck is about to explode right now. How am I losing money for this shit? I literally got rear-ended twice! Oh, fuck! Oh, fuck! Um, okay, okay, I'm going a little- I'm going a little too fast. I'm going a little too fast. That one was on me. Okay, make sure your oxygen generator is operating. Air filters are good. Filters are in good working condition. That any whole bridges have been patched. Uh, if I can make it over here, maybe, maybe I'll fix my ship completely. I, I can tell my my ship has been absolutely through the ringer. Can't do much about the oxygen right now, but I know I can do this. All right, so our our truck just completely got wrecked, just completely screwed. Uh, can I do repairs here? Do I have to do all these repairs by myself? Is that the thing? Do I have to do all these repairs by myself? I don't think so. I think I could actually go in here. There we go. All right, thank God. Nice! We're looking shiny now! Alright, that cost us nothing to do. Alright, I think I, I think it's safe to say I can get out of the seat. Put my uh, suit back on the rack. Man, let me tell you guys. In the last couple of clips, my giant forehead was completely exposed. Oh, this is cool. I didn't know you can actually go through these channels. My docking camera's on. All right, let's actually go meet Sour Candy and get this job done. We've been through like so many bumps and, and bruises today, man. It's actually been kind of nuts. Oh, can I go over the speed limit? I wonder. Will I get pulled over if I go over the speed limit? I might just keep my docking camera on the whole damn time. Are you shitting me? Wait, check. Are you shitting me, bro? I don't have anything on my my car right now. I guess this is the life of a trucker, huh? I'm eating sour candy. He can lick my balls. Breaker, breaker for Lucky J. You here for that job I mentioned? Great. I'm 
someone to haul something to Emerald Junction. I'd do it myself, but I really need to get back to my workshop. Should be some sweet lettuce on delivery, though. Just give me a moment here. Okay, I've sent you the delivery schedule. If you're too early, there'll be nowhere to park the trailer. And if you're too late, Barrel won't need the shipment anyway. So the trick is to optimize your route. It might be a quick turnaround, so you can't make it too quick, you copy? Great. Catch me on the rebound and let me know how it panned out. Oh yeah, while I was back there, I noticed, uh... I'm nobody. I'm not even in the car seat. <laughs> There's the cargo. Alright, let me see if I'm a speed demon. Let me see if I'm an actual speed demon. Can I can I hitch it from here? Just in case I have to go on Medusa 6, I'm gonna hitch it in the front. There we go. Nice. Purity, go into purity to... Okay, okay, cool. Oh shit, I'm gonna need fuel soon. I can make it. Be the speed demon I was meant to be, the real trucking machine. Slow this baby down a little bit. Raise it up a little bit. Slow it down a little bit. Thank God I'm on the right side. Are you shitting me? Breaker, breaker. This is a 1017. Welcome to Purity. This is an automated inspection checkpoint. Please be patient while we check for. I just lost two thousand dollars. That was mandatory. Results are satisfactory. Have a great day. Now where were we? Ah, yes. Breaker, breaker. This is a 1017 for Lucky J. Can I get you 20? This is JB checking on a report of an unregistered freight job. Oh my god. Something for sour candy. Sure. Well, I'm willing to let it slide this time. Just be careful in the future, alright? I don't know who the DIV is, nor do I care. I just lost two thousand dollars, bro. This is the worst. Oh, I just lost like half my money. I did not know that weight inspection was mandatory. All right, so we made it to the Emerald Junction. Finally, uh, without any hiccups. Well, how about that then? Perfectly on time, right on the stopwatch. Head on over and attach the merch at these coordinates. We'll have this job wrapped up in no time at all. All right, I feel like I'm doing something illegal, but that's okay. Do I have a hole leak? I don't think so. Something is up with the oxygen. It's the oxygen generator. Oh, here it is. They actually highlighted it for me. This should be good. Oh, do I not have a power cell? Oh, I think I have one in these boxes. No, I don't. I don't have a power cell at all, actually. this more than I need that for now. Cool. There we go. 
Oh wait, this is a this is a power cell. Yeah, I didn't realize that. Okay, cool. Everything's good in here. Everything's good in here. Okay, I was about to freaking asphyxiate myself, bro. I'm almost to my objectives. I can't stop now. Do a very sharp U-turn here. Nice and easy. matter that I got 1800 because I lost 2000 over there at Atlas Prime for not going to the way station oh my god man this was the this was a rough playthrough bro like that man it was like, <laughs> it was like four or five steps backwards but I hope you guys enjoyed man <laughs> that almost broke me comment like subscribe hit the bell if you want more notifications from the content machine Malcolm Extreme. Let me know if you want more space trucking, more star struck, <laughs> more star trucking, more star trucking videos. Uh, hit that like button if you want more. And uh, yeah, take it easy.